Hey, welcome everyone. In this video, I'm doing an unboxing of the Simple Human Smart Garbage Can. This is the smart garbage can from Simple Human that has voice uh, activation to open up the garbage can, which sounds crazy, but it's true, as well as uh, motion detection. Um, so while I'm doing this unboxing, don't mind my funky slippers. <laughs> they do keep me comfortable. Um, but focusing on the box itself, there's a lot of details around it. And it's a rather expensive product, but I was able to get it on sale. But more information will be in the review video. Link to that video will be in the video description. So this is one of the more uh, larger unboxings that I'm doing because the product is just fairly large. It's a 58 liter garbage can. That's the version that I got. Um, and as of today, it's the only one that comes with voice activation. So looking at the Simple Human documentation, there's some information from them. Um, and there's various pamphlets that they include. So one is a quick start guide explaining how to use it. Yeah, how to use a garbage can. I know, <laughs> sounds crazy. Um, one is a kind of a five-year warranty document saying that, you know, we guarantee your product for five years at the very least. So it does come with a five-year manufacturer's warranty. So very important to register your product. And another one is a... Uh, discount coupon codes. So if you make another purchase on Simple Human's website, hey, you get a discount on your next purchase. So trying to get the garbage can out because I don't want to yank the top. I'm not sure if it would damage the motor. It was a bit of a struggle to not damage it potentially. Um, but it's surprisingly light. It's weird that the box had most of the weight, whereas the garbage can itself it was a lot lighter than I expected. I thought that with the internal motor that it has to open and close the lid automatically, it would be heavier. Um, but hey, it's, it's not. So thankfully, putting it in its permanent spot will be rather easy. So I'm just having some difficulty getting the wrapper off. Um, it's really snug on there tight. And there's some other stuff there. So as I was mentioning, it's a 58 liter garbage can size, which is fairly large. And while you look at it compared to me, you could notice just how t tall it is. It's a fairly large garbage can. So it might not work for everybody, you know, especially if you have a smaller kitchen or the place you'll be putting it in is a lot smaller, but something to keep in mind. So I'm trying to get the stuff out of the back because what they do is include um, some sample garbage cans. Uh, sorry, sample garbage bags. <laughs> sorry, I keep saying can. So the bags, are the Q model and those are the ones that uh, are compatible with the garbage can at least from Simple Human. It's not to say you can't purchase your own garbage bags, you can certainly do that but if you want to purchase ones from Simple Human, it's the Q size. Again, all the information is in the review video. So they include 10 sample bags in the box uh, and within the can itself because there's a slot at the back where you can put the refills and I'm just trying to see how to figure out kind of open it up Again, without, you know, the worry of damaging the motor. Um, so we have some extra stuff here. And this is the power cord. I was looking for this. So what's great is that this is advertised as, you know, it needs power, obviously, because it's a smart garbage can. But you can use batteries or a power cord. And this is what I was trying to find. Where the heck was a power cord? And there you go. So that's pretty much it. I mean, it's pretty straightforward unboxing, although rather one of the larger ones. And I hope you guys like this video. Subscribe, it does help, and thanks for watching.